Hello, I'm Ed, and today I am going to show you how to install Chrome OS on your Windows or Mac OS machine using VirtualBox. Now, you can also do it on VMware as well, but I'm going to use VirtualBox in this video because it is a free program. So you need to download the cloud-ready Chrome OS file. And I'm going to put the links in the description down below. And here it is, just only uh, taking 1.08 gigabyte, uh, but it uh, should be good. So uh, the next one, of course, you also need the VirtualBox program. And of course, you know you where to go to. Just go to virtualbox.org, and you should uh, be able to download the VirtualBox version. So uh, let's uh, go ahead and start the setup process. And the first thing you need to do is to uh, open up the VirtualBox. Uh, program and just uh, click on that and you should be on the VirtualBox program uh, next thing is to click on file and then click import appliance let's click on import appliance right there and you need to click on the little folder with the arrow up icon and then choose the file right here the file you just downloaded the cloud ready uh, Chrome OS file click on that click open and click next the next thing you want to do is to change a couple of settings and make sure the settings uh, are right here first thing is to uh, make sure that the guest OS type is must be uh, Linux and then Despian 64 bit and uh, that is the OS type Despian 64 bit uh, the next thing you want to change let's see the CPU you can change this to two to a CPU, uh, you can see, and you better put at least two pieces of RAM on this uh, virtual machine. And uh, you need to put, uh, of course, make sure you use the controls on, make sure sound card, network adapter, and just make sure uh, something that is uh, best suited for you. And then click on import. It may take a while, um, so I'm we'll right back. Okay, so once you have done the process we need to click on the the one which is uh, imported so um, and just click on the settings click on the settings and uh, change a couple of more settings uh, the first thing is click on the system and and make in the multiple tab you need to make sure you enabled uh, the IO APIC and EFI so make sure these two are enabled so uh, next up to click on the processor and then you need to also make sure the PAE slash NX is also enabled as well. And next, I will do is click on display and uh, change the video memory to 128 megabytes and enable 3D uh, creations. And um, just uh, some other settings, for example, the audio, make sure it is enabled uh, to make the audio work. And network, make sure it is. N A T, and uh, so that is done. The uh, just couple of uh, setting into the virtual machine, and then next one to do is to start the uh, virtual machine. So, so uh, I want to tell you something that um, make sure you have a Google account in order to set up this because um, uh, you know, this is a Chrome OS and this is a Google operating system. So you need you must have. A Google account in order to um, uh, set up to the Chrome OS. So, um, and another one is in the setup uh, process. I don't know my case, but uh, the mouse doesn't work. You see, I click on the mouse, it says it will provoke the uh, capture uh, because the uh, mouse condition is grayed out at this point. So, you need to use a keyboard in order to uh, set it up. So, I'll use the uh, tap button, your know, tap key to navigate through the whole setup process. So you just need to make sure here and click continue. Tap enter to, uh, you know, uh, uh, to uh, confirm. And you need to accept and install. Just use a, use a tap on your keyboard. And uh, just gonna skip through here. And it says install and enter. Like just like that.
Okay, so once you, um, it might take a few more to um, set the installation, uh, but then uh, this is the important part is to sign in to your Chrome OS virtual machine. And I'm going to pause again to enter my group account. So I'll be right back. Okay, so once you've done uh, signing in to your Chrome OS, and then uh, should just take a little while to uh, setting uh, it up for the first time, and you should be into your uh, Chrome OS. So I still haven't been able to uh, put mouse aggression yet, but you know, uh, it'll take a little while. Uh, right now, let's use uh, you know tab key to navigate to the operating system. So uh, yeah. Okay, so ha I have um, started this uh, operating as a virtual machine, and you can see that uh, the mouse actually worked fine. Now you can see that uh, click on it and click on the virtual machine, it works. Just restart uh, the virtual machine, cover the time, and sh it should be fine. So um, you can s I'm gonna check the version here. You can see that uh, this works just fine. As you can see uh, this is the uh, control center here. Um, you can go to setting. You know, let's say. And uh, let's see what the version of this one, Google OS here, and it is 48.0.2564.116. So uh, it is a you know a bit modified version of Chrome OS. Uh, it's for virtual virtual machine, but it's just the same as Chrome OS. You can see that it is a. Uh, it should be starting with this one. So restore. Um, you know, cover. So check out some website. You can see it working. It works just fine here, YouTube, and um, yeah, should be working just fine. It's just like some any other um, Chrome OS device. And in order to go out, you need to click on. You need to um, press on the right control, the right control, okay, to the right, not the the left control, the right control, and boom, it will appear the outside one here, and we click. You want to go back, just do the same, or click on the display and just go on the to machine, it should work just fine. But that's uh, basically how to install Chrome OS on um, the um, uh, Windows or Mac OS machine uh, using VirtualBox. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you uh, just said, just, uh, just like, comment, and subscribe down below and uh, for more videos. Uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.